Welcome back, everybody. This is Eric here with Iraq Veteran 8888. Uh, we're making our man can announcement for the month, and we're reporting from Command Central here. This is probably not a place you're used to seeing. This is our editing room where we uh, put together all the videos for you guys. Uh, we've had a very exciting year. We've really enjoyed it. We've had a lot of great support from you guys and a lot of great support from the companies that we work with uh, with man cans. Uh, some of you guys are probably watching this video and you're going, okay, what's a man can? Well, a man can is kind of a support box that we put together where uh, it's $30 plus $8.50 for shipping. And uh, basically it's a way that you can help support the channel. Uh, we send you out a uh, box of cool merchandise. Uh, each month we select a theme and uh, you pre-order pre the can. It comes uh, a month later and it embraces the, you know, the items in the box embrace the theme that we select. Uh, December's theme was called Gift of Gun, and uh, I have December uh, box right here. We're going to unbox it for you here in just a moment, but I always like to announce uh, the next theme. So January's theme is New Year's Revolution. Uh, kind of a play on words there, but the items in that can are going to be related to our founding fathers and to American patriotism and uh, uh, American, uh, let's just say, we have a bit of a history of being rabble rousers and uh, we stir the pot a little bit and uh, we, we have a history of that. So I hope that the, the items in that cam will really embrace that theme well. So January is, uh, you know, New Year's Revolution. So make sure you get over there and get that. Uh, we limit the quantity on the cans to uh, around 1500 per month. We don't really like to go too crazy on them because we want to make sure that we can fulfill the uh, items and get them out to you in a timely manner and everything like that. So uh, get them while you can. Uh, it is kind of a limited thing. Each month uh, we do a custom fight soap. We do a custom patch from Bastion. Those are, those are the two constants that we know will be in every can. And then the rest of the items are things that we select and we, we kind of put together. And, and a lot of them are custom one-off items. And uh, they're usually related to the channel. They usually have some type of branding for the channel and everything like that. So uh, this is the December can, Gift of Gun. We're going to go ahead and break it open. This is a box I kind of mocked up a little bit. It's got a green label, red tape holding it shut. We, we are in the process of changing around the box to something a little bit more professional looking. Um, I know that we've gotten a lot of... Uh, complaints from you guys about some of these boxes getting torn up and uh, stepped on and thrown around and everything. So we, we selected a, a much sturdier box to ship this stuff in uh, to make sure it gets to you guys in one piece. Eventually, we are going to have custom printed boxes, which I think is kind of cool. It's going to cost us a little bit extra money, but I think that it's just neat to have that kind of thing and uh, kind of take it to the next level, so to speak. Uh, but we got our custom fight soap, and this one smells like peppermint bark. So you got a Christmas-related uh, fight soap. And uh, bear in mind, guys, this is December can. So th this is you know, on the way to your doorstep right now as I'm breaking this open. So if you don't want to be surprised and you don't want to spoil the surprise, you might not want to watch this part of the video. But on that same token, I like to talk about uh, the items that are in the can so that I'm completely transparent with you guys so you know exactly the kind of things you're getting. Uh, so the exact items that are in this box are the exact things that you're going to get. Uh, but of course, January is a mystery. That's the whole point, okay? You got your fight soap. We got a bunch of other cool things. All right, here's our custom patch. Uh, we did the Grinch, and he's got his uh, Santa's, you know, gift bag full of guns, and he's got combat boots on, and he's wearing an ammo belt around him. He's got a mischievous uh, kind of look on his, uh, on his face. So there's our custom patch, all right, for December. You probably saw a video we did recently called Christmas Gift Ideas for Shooters, and we were talking about all different kind of random things that you can give the gun person in your life. And uh, at one point, we talked about these Atlas uh, whiskey bombs and uh, the bourbon bullets. Okay, those are the two products that he sells. Well, in this month's man can, you guys are getting two bourbon bullets. All right. Now, these things retail for a pretty good amount of money, and Joe was kind enough to cut me a, a pretty decent break on them so that I could get those uh, in the can for you guys. Uh, these things are awesome. Uh, you put them in the freezer, ice them down, put them in your favorite spirit or beverage, and the whole idea is that it'll keep your beverage cold uh, without having to water down your beverage. You don't have any melting ice to contend with, so you can have a, a, a cold spirit, like a little shot or something, without having to you know, water it down. Some of your finer beverages, like a nice scotch or something, you don't want to water it down. You want to drink it neat to get the, the intended flavor of the spirit. But with that being said, the bourbon bullets definitely do the trick uh, if that's something you're into. Hopefully, if you ordered the can, you're into drinking or you know someone that is, 
that's an awesome item and I was really banking on the fact that you would really enjoy that item because that constitutes like a big part of what I saw in terms of value in this month's uh, can. I really, really like that. So uh, moving on with a couple of other items. Now, I feel compelled to really talk about this soon. So Fostec gave you guys a $200 off coupon. All right, now guys, that's, that's not a joke. That is a considerable savings. Like if you've ever wanted to buy a AR Defender stock or a Bumsky stock or something like that, uh, they're a great bunch of guys over there and they make really high quality products. But if you've ever wanted one and you've been wondering about it between then and now, there's no better time to buy one than now. So that's a $200 off coupon there. That was really nice of them uh, to put that in this can for you guys. Uh, moving on, now Bastion stepped up and, uh, and did some really awesome stuff for us this month. We've been working with Bastion quite a bit. Um, of course, you saw the patch already, and you probably saw in our Christmas gift uh, you know, idea video, we showed you a lot of the other things that Bastion makes, like floor uh, plates and things like that. But he did this Christmas ornament for us, and everything came together really nice with that. And uh, what we're probably going to end up doing is each year with Man Cans, every December, we will do some type of custom Christmas ornament. Uh, my only minor complaint with this, not really a complaint, but something that I probably should have had the foresight to address is maybe putting the year on it so we can tell them apart in the future. But so next, next time, next year, we'll have the actual year that the, the ornament came from, and that way for some of you guys that are collecting them, want to put them on your tree, uh, we'll have a custom one each year. I think that'd be kind of fun to start that as kind of a little, a little Iraq veteran tradition there. So there's your Christmas ornament. Uh, awesome though, I came together really nice. All right, we did these pins. Uh, one year I was given a gift from somebody and it was, a, it was a custom ink pen in the shape of a bullet and I thought it was such a cool idea. I wanted to get something like that made for you guys. So here we've got, it looks kind of like a 308 or maybe a 300 mag or 30-06. You know, it basically just looks like an unassuming uh, cartridge there, but it's a pen. All right, so you can write with it, whatever you want to do. So I thought that was interesting. And what we were going for in this can with these items is things that, like if you get the stuff and you're like, all right, well, I may not be crazy about the bourbon bullets because I don't drink or whatever. The idea is that you can give these to somebody that, that does and they might find that just to be the coolest thing since sliced bread. So it's stuff that can, that can be of use to you and maybe to give to someone else too. All right, so we've got an Ackless sticker. Uh, he, he made up some special stickers. And the interesting thing about these stickers I know how stickers are. Some people don't care about them. Some people love them. But we always like to put some type of little stickers in each can just because. Uh, but he put a lot of these interesting little sayings. Uh, you know, you've got the little uh, Boba Fett down there, and he's, he's got a little, you know, saying on each one. So some of them are different, and they have, you know, various sayings. So you don't really know what you'll get because he, you know, used a bunch of different ones on them. Bastion also puts together a little holiday sticker here. This is kind of fun. All right. So stickers are kind of what they are, but we always put some sort of sticker in the can. Um, this was an idea right here that I thought would be a lot of fun. This is a stencil pack that I had made for you guys. Uh, this is another Bastion product. Uh, let, me, let me tear this thing open. So what I was thinking is, all right, so thinking about things that can keep on giving, something you can kind of keep on using. So say you were to use these stencils. Say you've got a... Uh, an ammo can that you put all your AR-15 stuff in or something. Take this and spray it. All right, you got a silhouette of an AR, you says AR-15, you know that's your AR-15 can, all right? You could spray this over your, you know, coffee table, like I've got this Mosin crate here if you wanted to, you could do anything you wanted. You could spray this on your can and then pass these over to a buddy and use it and pass it along to somebody else. That was kind of my idea there uh, because these stencils can be used over and over and over again. So we've got one for an AR-15. We've got one for a pistol. So you can spray that, you know, for your Glock, or whatever. If you've got a pistol can, AK-47. All right, we did the Mosin Nagant. So like if you've got a random 30 cal can full of a 54R, or if you've got a, a 30 cal can full of stripper clips or a bunch of accessories for your Mosin, spray it on there and you can easily identify uh, that thing. Now I expect you guys to come up with some really creative things to do with these things. So like maybe different colors, like you could do the, you know, the rifle in black and like the uh, letters in red and just make it look kind of custom, you know. That's what I was going for there. And then of course, last but not least, we've got shotgun. Little guy there. All right. So if you got a random can of 12 gauge laying around or something, I thought the stencils would be a really fun thing to, to put in there. Go. Disperse. 
Uh, I thought that the, the stencils would be really good to put in there for that reason. And then we did, last but not least, a guitar pick with the IRAT Veteran logo on it. And I know it's not real significant, but I thought it would be really fun just to have, you know, some of you guys are musicians. Maybe you know someone who's a musician. Maybe you know somebody who's a fan of the channel, but they also happen to be maybe a guitarist. This is a great item to pass over to somebody just as a, a little token, uh, maybe between friends or whatever. So there's the can for December. I felt like the items are pretty strong and they embrace the theme really well. Um, I know it's, it doesn't have the appearance of being like physically a lot of things, uh, but I was trying to go for things that were useful and something that maybe you could, you know, give a friend or give away to somebody. So there's December's can. I hope you guys uh, enjoy it and put everything in it to good use and, you know, have the ornament on your tree and everything. So I think that'll be kind of fun to have an ornament. But uh, we really appreciate the support. Uh, we've been getting a lot of uh, support for man cans. This has been a really interesting year. Uh, you know, we, we haven't even fully announced the January theme yet uh, through this video until now, but we've had several orders coming through already just by word of mouth and people kind of, I know some of you guys kind of snipe the website and look for like the minute that the can gets announced, you buy it. Uh, I know we promised you guys a subscription service. Uh, we are going to get that going here very soon within the next couple of weeks. And what we're going to do is we're going to let everybody subscribe to Man Cans at their leisure over the next uh, remaining days in December, going into January, and then all the way for like the first couple of weeks of February. And what we'll do is February's can, when it begins to ship, uh, we will make February's can the one that you're actually subscribing to. So January's can will go out in the middle of February. And when you're subscribing, you're subscribing for February's can going into March. And that way it gives you guys plenty of time to go over there and, and get into the subscription service. That way you never miss a can. You're always guaranteed to get a can. And if there's any special offers or anything random like that that are getting put out there, uh, you'll have an opportunity to take advantage of those first over someone who's not subscribed. Uh, that's a question that we've been getting a lot from you guys wanting to know when we're going to offer a subscription service and how that service is going to go. Uh, we will have more details on that soon. Uh, just make sure that you're ch uh, checking your emails and keep up with us on Facebook and uh, make sure you're keeping up on these YouTube videos because as more information is uh, available for it, I'll put all of that out through those outlets. So make sure you're checking all of those uh, to make sure you're staying on top of it. We've gotten a lot of great support from Man Cans. A lot of people have really liked this concept. They like where we're going with it. They like how personal it is and how it's from us. It's almost like from my camp to yours. And you're supporting the channel financially, but then you're also getting something cool in exchange. So that's our goal with it. And we want it to be kind of exclusive like that. We don't want this to get to the point where we've got so many orders that it feels like we're running some crazy global empire or something. It's, it's not like that. We want it to be very, very, very home, home oriented, kind of personal, like, like from your family would be in a way. So, I mean, with the amount of subscribers that we have, I mean, we, we could probably sell a heck of a lot more than we do, but, but I like the idea of keeping it very exclusive and small uh, so that it's, it's more important that way. If you know that, you know, 30,000 people are getting a man can, it's kind of like, all right, well, I'm just a number. But when it's so few, you're not really a number anymore. You're more of a person. And, you know, I know Brandy responds to a lot of you guys personally on an individual basis. If there's ever a problem or there's ever any kind of issue with a man can or you're not happy or whatever, just let us know and we'll deal with you all on an individual basis because that's just how we do things. So anyway, I'll let you get back to your day. Thank you so much for watching today. We've got a ton of awesome stuff on the way. More meltdowns, more five guns, more gunsmithing videos gun gripes, gun reviews, you name it, we're doing it. Uh, we're trying to set the standard for how people uh, watch footage on YouTube. I mean, we, we try our best to establish ourselves as being the kind of people that, that produce good quality content and make people happy and truly listen to our viewers. I mean, if you have an idea for a video, go on Facebook and leave, leave us a note on our Facebook page. I will read every single one of them. And if it's an awesome idea and I like it and we can do it, we'll do it. So that's the kind of people we are. We like to take requests. So if you got an idea, you let us know and we'll accommodate it. So uh, thanks for your time. Have a good one. We'll catch you next time.